my camera only records 100 frames per second. Where's the 120? What is good YouTube? It's that one camera guy back at again with another video. In this episode, we go over a quick and short tutorial on how to switch your Sony mirrorless camera from NTSC to POW and vice versa. Let's jump into it. This video came about because someone had a question about this on my guide and they were trying to figure out why on earth they only have 100 frames per second listed on their camera where the camera is actually advertised to shoot at 120 frames per second. Here's the dilemma with NTSC and PAL. Typically NTSC is used in North America while countries outside of the area is using PAL. However, the lines between the two aren't so black and white before where, for example, content had to be filmed in a certain format and it couldn't be played on the other format and vice versa. But that's not really a big deal with a lot of digital content outlets now. I'm not gonna get into the specifics about all of that because that's not what this video is. I wanna switch from NTSC and PAL is to get different frame rates. So for example, on NTSC, you're able to shoot at 24, 60, and 120p. On the other hand, if you're set in PAL, you shoot at 25, 50, and 100. For those of you wondering how to switch between those modes, I'm gonna show that in this tutorial. Before we start, the one thing I do ask you to do is actually either take the memory card out or format it. Because if you don't, you're gonna lose the files that are already on there because it must format the camera in order for this process to work. So I have several cameras that I'm gonna show you how to set it up. Now I don't have every Sony camera out there, so I can't show it to you on different formats, but I do have some that I can show you. So if you have an Alpha 6300 or an RX100 Mark IV, you just go ahead and click on the menu button on your camera, go to tab six, page three, and then you're gonna see an option that says choose NTSC or PAL selector. Go ahead and click on that and choose enter. Your camera will reboot and then it will now be in the opposite format. If you have the newer Alpha 6500, it's also very similar. Click the menu button, navigate to tab six, page three, choose the NTSC PAL selector and press enter. It's that simple. If you have a Sony a7R II, click on the menu button, go to tab six, page two, choose the NTC PAL selector and press enter. And that's it, that's how you quickly jump from the settings. Now, if you go into your video modes now, you will see that you have different frame rate recording options available. Now, how do you go back? Just go to the settings again and you can quickly jump back between the two. If you found this helpful, consider giving it a like. If you do wanna see more content, tutorials and stuff and guides about the Alpha 6500, consider subscribing. And with that said, I'm your host, Dylan Camera Guy, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.